Okay, this is just a follow-up video from the brief demonstration we did with uh, rainwater earlier. Um, we're trying to make this into a, a marketable product. So what we've done, we mounted the WLC level controller inside a um, IMO small distribution box. This is quite useful because it's IP65, so it um, can be mounted outside. So that's quite useful. We take the lid off. Inside we've got the IMO um, level controller and we've set this so that it's pumping uh, in the pump up position and set it to a few seconds delay uh, in the um, off position. We're using our own sensor this time and there's two contacts there which dip into the water so all this is sealed up. The reason for using this system is because most rainwater storage tanks are made of plastic so this will be mounted on a plastic tank either at the top or it could go in at the side. It could go in at the side or at the top. So when it dips into the water there's a few seconds delay and it goes off. Take it out. A little bit of delay. And it goes off. Useful because if you if there are if it's a big tank and there are waves in the tank, it smooths those waves out. And um, saves saves intermittent operation of the solenoid valve. Connection to the box, once the box is mounted the user will uh, connect the sensor and then the solenoid valve on this side as well. Um, SELV will be used throughout so it's quite safe for the solenoid valve, we'll be using the main solenoid valve, it will be a 24 volt solenoid safety reasons. So hopefully we can uh, do something with that and uh, maybe sell a few. Keep your fingers crossed. Bye now.